hold the stick back into the vertical, establish that line, and as she reaches zero airspeed, she'll kick in the hard left rudder just at the right moment. Applies a little opposite aileron and completes the hammerhead. Now, while Julie's T-34 is fully capable of aerobatics, it's much larger and heavier than most aerobatic show airplanes. So it demands concentration to execute precise, ma precise maneuvers, and as Julie says, it's two hands on the stick. Throws that stick over to the left into the upright position. In a maneuver created by accident, actually, in 1936 by the late Len Covey at the Miami Air Races. He was too low at the top of a loop to safely complete it, so he did what Julie did, and then did the same thing in the opposite direction. At the end of the performance, they said, what was that? And since Len Povey had been teaching Batista's Air Force pilots to fly aerobatics, he replied, Ocho Cubano, Cuban aid, and the name has stuck. She pulls up on the 45, rolls it over on its back this time for the reverse one-half Cuban eight. She'll set up for the four-point hesitation roll next. This is an amazing sight and such a talented pilot.